Hello everyone, I'm Santiago Santiago and today I'm gonna be testing Sniper Ghost Warrior 3 on the G4 CDX 1050Ti for PS my train, I'll be using Cam. If you want to download this software, there's a link down in the description. And if you want to purchase any of the parts featured in this build and support the channel, there are Amazon affiliate links down in the description. So Sniper Ghost Warrior 3, I'll be doing 1080p, 900p and 720p. To skip down to those sections of the video, check the description below. I would also be testing this with an i5-7400 to see if there is any difference compared to the Pentium in this game in particular. I couldn't get 60 frames per second on 1080p, that's why I just tested one setting. Even at lower setting it was impossible to get 60s, so I did some kind of balanced settings to get 30 to 45 frames, more or less. Then on 900p and 720p it was possible to get 60 frames per second, so I did a 30 frames per second configuration and a 60 frames per second configuration, so you can choose from one of those. And I will also be showing you briefly 1440p, at that resolution, even at the lower setting, it was impossible to get 30 frames per second. I was on the mid-20s, so I'll be briefly showing you that. On the CPU side of things, I noticed that the G4560 was enough to get 60 frames per second. Using an i5 wasn't that much different. I just found that stuttering was less often, but it was still happening a lot. So it doesn't seem to be a CPU issue this time around. So in the options menu, the first things that you should lower are not single settings. Unfortunately, this game doesn't have like a setting that bumps up the performance magically, like other games. So in this case, I suggest lowering first post-processing, shader quality, shading and shadows. Those gave me a good FPS boost, so sh lower them together first, then you see what happens. You'll see that I do that across all my videos on this game. And then to get another extra frames, just lower in-game effects, object detail, particles and physics all together. So personally, what I do is just keep the first ones that I mentioned on i don't know medium and the other ones that i told you to lower later one step above so for example on the 1050 ti when i tried to get 60s i just kept post-processing shaders and shadows lower to low and then the other things that i told you to lower later on medium and so far it's been working out well i suggest you check it out yourself but after changing some of the options you should restart the game in order for the changes to apply there are no anti-aliasing or texture options which is ridiculous due to that the game uses a lot of vram and we can do nothing about it other than lowering the resolution i noticed on cards that have four gigs of vram or more that the vram usage is insanely high on 1080p medium settings, you are looking at over 4 gigs of usage of VRAM. They could at least add a, a different texture quality option for GPUs with lower VRAM, but they didn't. So most of the starters that I saw are related to VRAM usage. Due to the lack of VRAM, Windows 10 seems to be allocating that to the RAM. That's why on the 2GB cards, the RAM usage seems to be higher. But the game also uses a lot of hard drive when it's loading new assets. That's why when I zoom in with my sniper rifle, you'll sometimes see muddy textures or stuff popping up. That creates a stutter. That's because it's streaming it from the hard drive. So yeah, that's all I have to say about this game. They should have cared more about the PC version, at the very least, at a texture option. Even worse, PC ports have this option. But Overall, I think that this game needed more time before release. They should have delayed this further, but it's too late to do that now. But yeah guys, that's pretty much it. I hope you keep enjoying the video, thanks for watching and see you next time.
such pieces of shit like you were born to die in vain. Oh good. This is it, is it? This is the day I enter hell. Perimeter is this. Thank you. Could you get me across the border? Roger. It's heavily guarded. Won't be easy to sneak into the building. Try to find the other way. Maybe you can take him out from a distance. Movement on the perimeter!
must be nearby. Search the perimeter. Everybody down. Roger. It's heavily guarded. Won't be easy to sneak into the building. Try to find the other way. Maybe you can take him out from a distance.
target. Where are you? Report. Spread out.